Okay, so what I'm talking about today is um, how do we maintain harmony of the universe on, on Earth, um, and also how, how I got into this whole topic of uh, or practice of Chico. Also causes quantum coherence because it it resonates the um, the whole microtubule, uh, but it's it's actually the the bicycle or the the um, high resonance that's you know, the, the tubules, and so it, it's a non commutative phase that's causing this. Um, and so. Essentially, all right, I know, I'm just going all over the place with it. When I was, I took, I studied piano, I studied it in the five classroom, which is so strange. <laughs> it ended up with me playing the rock band in the, in the class for I had got wired, but it was a lot of fun, but I was, I was technically a but that's not why I got into it. I turned out my mom got into it, and I was like, dude, go down there. I was like, yeah, no, it's just that it's not just that it's not just that it's not just that it's I don't remember where I was like, yeah, this is what people are not happy with. That's why I was like, yeah. But then, when I was taking it seriously, I realized there was some philosophical things that I was going to do. And so, if you look at my radar, Yeah. Uh-huh. 
what's happening is going back to the The female is young and tall. You know, what I like to do is that the female is So it turned out it was somebody from the the Dalbums forum, and they they wanted to meet me. So and since Jim, I said, Jim, okay. So he comes out and stays in the house. That's the Yangqing energy. And then and he realized that that activates the vagus nerve. So that brings it full circle to what I'm trying to get at. Is these, is once you have the delocalized protons, then you're dealing with your uh, non-local Wan Chi, which is your uh, the reverse procession, which Pulich figured out, is the elf subharmonic. Now the elf subharmonic is what they call the shaking medicine with the Dr. Bradford Keeney. Brad Keeney. He used to be at the University of St. Thomas, which is where we had our chi uh, meetings or practice sessions uh, with the chi master, the grand chi master. And so he he has a promo on his book from uh, Dr. Er, Patrick Dorry. Do- 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 anyway, he was a, a psychologist who trained he became a Chino master himself. He was, he was a, kind of like, uh, he were, he was friends with Jim. I think they did like karate together or something. I don't know. Um, anyway, or no, they did Zen meditation. Zen meditation together. Okay. So, yeah, it's kind of a small world in the academia and the esoteric meditation scene. And uh, Stuart, he goes to Boundary Waters to go canoeing, so that's pretty awesome. Um, so 
Okay, so unless a male trains to be young internally through the vagus nerve, then you have this hardwired evil as the ch what I call chimpanzee culture. And that's what runs Earth right now is you get these males running around. Whereas our original human culture required all the males to do this young, internal young training. And they just said, you, you visualize the fire in the belly and that creates steam of the water. And that's really all you need to know where the fire is your spirit as your mind. And the steam is the Wan Chi, which they called Nom, or I, I can't make the, the the sounds, but the, so I totally rambled all over, but that's all I'm saying for now, thanks.